All right, <clears throat> I'm gonna try to get back to the Eagle Library in a different way. <clears throat> kind of uh, dancing with other people pulling out I want to go to yeah I want to go in a different way I just I got the route plotted <coughs> and it's it's not the route that I want and I can't well I, I don't know how to change it so I'm just kind of winging it I guess I'll just keep my iPad on and and just pay attention I did do a little bicycling it was really nice the air is cleaner around here and well the weather's just nice right now it's nice to get away from Boise a little further away but <laughs> I can't get too far away the further I get away the further I have to drive back <clears throat> you know the all right all right semen semen semens all right, I got. All right, this is the the right I want to take. Now, I suggested taking a left for the best route, but I was already that way. I know that route. I want to go a different way. All right, so that takes Siemens, and then Dry Creek Road would be. There's a weird. Okay, there's a weird intersection. Dry Creek Road. I want to see what that's all about. Dry Creek Road. Just do a little exploratory. Guys, I like I like the the scenery around here. <clears throat> Walking around, it's pretty nice. It's nice to look down on things. It's nice to have hills. Hills are very very useful for exercise and and uh, your ability to see so it's saying stop up ahead stop is this the weird intersection oh yeah okay all right so I want dry creek road cross traffic does not stop so that this this truck coming uh, he probably won't stop <clears throat> All right, so now it's 35 and they warn of cows. Cows are an issue. <clears throat> Whoops, what? It's saying, it's saying I'm going on broken something. No, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm like, no, I, I'm pretty sure I just looked at the road. I should be on Dry Creek. Just kind of inspecting. I see a lot of broken farm equipment. An old barn. They've given up on barns around here. They tried and then found it wasn't all that necessary. But they really don't seem to milk cows. I don't know. They don't really see many milk cow places. I can kind of see why I was not directed to use this road 20 20 hill blocks view and it's saying 20 I'm going I'm driving like a madman at 25 and I got a car behind me who's probably in a hurry but it's saying 20 so hey there's cows all right yeah that, that guy's gonna tail me pretty closely I probably could pull over for him you know, I don't know how many cars to expect around here. Uh, yeah, this... Oh, there's another cow. They're just eating sagebrush. I really don't feel like stopping. Just to let him pass. Oh, there he can... He can cross if he wants. No, no, he said he's staying too risky, too risky. <laughs> it's not too risky for him to follow me real close. 
No? Alright. It's saying 25. I gotta go slow. I don't know what's going on around here. It's, it's pretty crazy turns, I'll tell you that much. I'd be interested in watching it on, on a faster speed. Looks like the rain has stopped. 20 miles an hour. Wow. And again, the hill blocks the view, and there's a lot of cows. Maybe t less than 50. 25. Oh, there's a lot over there. Oh, wow. Alright, this is some real dairy land around here. Some real dairy, but I gotta race through it because I got this person on right on my tail. Okay, alright. Yep. You in a hurry, you can cross. You can... No, no, it's too risky. Let's see how this goes. There's no, I don't see anybody else behind them, but it's hard to see. Got a bicycler coming at me. 25. All right. So, I just want to be careful. I want to take a left on this highway. It looks like Google Maps has lost me, and I, I see the highways coming up. Or maybe I'm just, I, I could have zoomed in too much. I'm just going the speed limit. I don't see anywhere that I was actually going over the speed limits or even under it. I usually try to pay close attention to the speed limit when there's somebody behind me. I usually, you know, the closer they follow me, the more they look like they're in a hurry. All right, all right, so Google Maps has lost me, but I'm pretty sure I gotta take a left here. All right, I got a couple of cars to wait out. Yeah, if this person wants to uh, pass me up, they're welcome to. Otherwise, I'm just going to gradually speed up. Alright, so... I seem to be off course a little bit on the map. That makes me a little concerned. Whoop! Alright, entering town, it looks like. Now, I'm a little... Okay, I see, yeah, there's going to be a lot of, a lot of town to navigate through. Alright, but I should be coming up upon E Hill Dr Road. So I'll just, I'll drive till I get to Hill Road. And uh, see how it works. So that vehicle's got past me now. Just, yeah, okay, it's a curve. <clears throat> they got rocks for sale here. And you wouldn't believe the prices they charge for rocks. I was surprised to see in Pendleton the cost. <clears throat> 55, okay. coming down and want to make that right on hill so it was a little it was interesting to take a different route from hidden springs to eagle hill all right right on hill this library should be open till 8, I believe, on Thursday. Whoop! Alright, so now stopping. 
None of them are hitting their, their brakes. There they go. Oh, okay, they're trying to time it. Okay. Yeah, I'm a little further from Boise. How important is it that I actually be downtown? I'm thinking the food bank, but I should take another look at food banks. <clears throat> Maybe there's some that I won't need to go downtown to, to reach. I really like the one in Meridian, but I don't want to step foot in Meridian again. Okay. So Google Maps is still following me and Hill is coming up real quick. I'm going a little slower because yeah this I don't know exactly where it'll be. It's it's it looks like it'll be this road up here by the looks of Google Maps. Hill, okay. So I take a right on hill. Yeah, my brakes are really funny. They don't they don't feel even. Alright. When you hit brakes, I think they're supposed to feel even. Man, that's money to invest. Whoa. Alright, so now I go straight. I believe it's 35. Yeah, I wonder if this car needs a bit of a tune-up for uh, having replaced the alternator. Maybe that's that's part of the problem. It's just how do you tune it up? I gotta look into that. All right. Um, so this road, this road takes me, I've been on this road before, yep. <laughs> Alright, maybe I should just stop this. Yeah, State Street. I've been on this road, I've already recorded it for one. <clears throat> yeah, I'm on Hill. So it's just a matter of hitting a curve and then then I'll see State Street. Really, I've been on this road? Seems strange. Thought I would have taken the other road. Alright, so I wonder if I should try to park on the side of the library or in the parking lot. I can't, I didn't, I wasn't able to get the internet from the the side on the side street at all so it doesn't really seem worth it for that okay so coming up upon state and I can't really say the internet's too bad here I had a on the first day I had some problems but then they they have two internets and it seemed to clear up when I switched over to the other one all right, so I want to take a right here. Not, not on Winding Creek, but the next one. State. Yeah. It's like I got I got bumps on my my brake pad. All right, so I I kind of remember where I need to turn, but kind of not. Oh, okay, I think yeah. I think I know. 25, go slow. So it's, uh, yeah, I think I'll just turn here. 
lights. So I've been driving for a while. The car should be pretty warmed up. It still likes to raise in RPMs, and I just... I'm a little concerned about that. <clears throat> okay. Man, it... Just try to coast into a spot. There we go. 